People shooting off guns for the fourth in the city. Bullets are still affected by gravity. Boyfriend decided to try out a new hairdresser. This photo my dad took of me at Machu Picchu. Don't leave your kayak out in the sun. Wife got assigned a random tag at the DMV, didn't read it till she got home. Someone managed to lose their new box of lost item trackers. Imagine going to school for 12 years and graduating at Walmart. Apartment hallway in Dallas, Texas looks like a scene from the Titanic. Got my license in the mail today. Hope they feel better soon. My toddler and I walk to the park just to find that the whole playground has been removed. I asked the kids to check on how many eggs we had left, quote we have plenty. My neighbors had a party last night, that's my trampoline. I made a lasagna for lunch. Here's the result. Forgetting about your pizza for 8 hours, burnt so bad it looks like a double chocolate brownie. Spraying weed killer instead of weed and feed. Forgetting to roll up the window all the way. Paid extra for this window seat. Slipped in the shower, landed on the toilet. Lamborghini Huracan flooded due to rain in Sao Paulo, it was not insured. My girlfriend opened her jewelry making box upside down. God damn it. I forgot to take the old coffee pot out of the coffee maker before making cup noodles. When the tiger shark you're photographing swims off with your camera rig. Driving my wife's new car, still on the first tank of gas, when this happened. With my remaining 3% battery on my phone, I post this. Where's everyone at? How do you guys like my new shower? Went down to the basement to do laundry. Christmas lunch ruined for a few extra dollar sign on way in. Finish sorting my cards, and then I fell. Main water valve was not shut off for the winter in a cabin. Oops. Found discarded on the side of a building today, felt bad seeing it. This 4 inch brain tumor I am getting removed tomorrow. My 11 month old son just hit me in the face with his toy, and broke my tooth in half. I did not look closely enough at that label. I feel this. Breaking news, local idiot spills spaghetti on her bed. As if covered 19 and losing jobs wasn't bad enough, we just lost both cars to a tree. Happy Easter everyone. I took some aspirin, when I was tired it was really late at night, I realized an hour later, that what I took was not aspirin. Minus 25 outside heavy grocery bag, no gloves, long reunion slash chat with old friend in parking lot, gravity. I got shot at this morning, because I flashed my headlights, and honked at a group of early 20 yo kids that cut me off in traffic which almost caused me to wreck. My multi-million dollar healthcare company said they were getting us a present for being essential workers, we got a bag of masks. GF and I have covered, heater went out, technician can't come out due to quarantine, decided to try and fix it myself, tripped over a pipe, and fell through the ceiling, anyone need a handyman? See those eggs, they are supposed to be in the pies, I made two hot oily chocolate garbage circles. Someone in my town, fell 30 feet down a well through the floor of their house they didn't know existed, literally a well that sucked. See that tiny sliver of metal in the gap, those are my car keys, that are locked in the groove of my trunk. Bought a house in July and they graciously left me a mini fridge in the basement, after moving all my beer and alcohol downstairs I discovered it was in fact a freezer. I've been saving up for a switch for a couple months now, I finally got it last week, and found this in my dog's mouth this morning. 
got home from work today, realized I've been walking around meeting clients with a giant 627 in rip in my pants that no one said anything about, so I figured the internet should also know. I'm the guy that had the overflowing septic, broken fridge and the cancer, about to go in and get rid of my nut, then chemo in a couple of weeks. Thanks all for your support last post. Spent two and a half hours making pizzas from scratch for my mother and myself, but she was too ill from her chemotherapy to make it to the dinner table. Been a hard few months, but this one stings. Parents retired this March and bought their dream ranch house in the Co Mountains on 400 acres. Now there's a 4,000 acres fire that's 0% contained about a mile from them. No evacuation order for them yet, but we expect it's coming. 